Here's the overall picture of it. Um, it's pretty dirty right here, as you can see. Um, dingy and dirty, just pretty much everywhere. Just really needs to be cleaned. And then on the back side too, you can see there's a lot of discoloration. And some different marks and spots. It looks like ink. The leather on the bottom is actually in very good shape except for a little wear on the corners, which isn't bad. And we'll try to clean that up just a little bit too. Anyway, I think with just a little bit of tender loving care, this can be a really nice overnight bag or beach bag for my daughter. So I'm gonna to try to clean it up and we'll see what happens. Okay, I'm going to clean this in my sink. I'm going to use a scrub brush. I'm going to use, this is a method bottle, but I like that it foams. So I do very, very diluted kitchen um, dish soap. I like Dawn. And I'm going to use Shout Stain Remover. I find that I use this on... Okay, um, now I have, I scrubbed the leather. And I scrubbed the sides where it was really dirty right here. Maybe it needs a little bit more there, but it always looks so much better after it dries. Here's the front of it, which was really dingy and dirty. Here's the other end. And here's the back that looked like it had like ink and a lot of really, really dirty spots all along here. And it's wet, so it looks pretty good. And I, since this is one where the inside does not pull out, I've had a large one like this before where the inside would come out and I just pulled that out and cleaned it separately. Um, while I had this all wet, rather than have to do it again and wet the leather, I did go ahead and I just sprayed down the inside with the shout and then scrubbed it a little bit and rinsed it out really good. And now I'm going to let it dry. Um, I'm going to place it somewhere upside down and I'm going to try to shape the bottom of the leather so that it will dry. And then we'll check back in and see what it looks like.